faces is in roll beads with F smash and down smash and getting some really early kills. So I'm really excited to see what he does in the cloud matchup, which I personally think can be hard for Roy sometimes. Blade Beam and the not needing the sour the, the tipper or sour spot for Cloud making it a little harder for Roy to get in, but definitely interesting to see how this goes between two very good players. I absolutely. Ooh, how did he not get that grab on the parry? It was oh, like right there. And beautiful, beautiful SDI by Foon there on that up getting out of almost getting out of that second hit. Right now, two, the, these two players just playing neutral and just looking for kind of stray hits. No no real combos yet. Zion, though, does have the limit and finds himself in a disadvantage here. This could be big, but Yoon finding a way to get down and reset to neutral. Uh, cloud back air is... Might as well still be DLC. <laughs> like, oh, it, it is. It's, it's better it's, than most characters. Uh, like, we have... Oh, he, he has the four as they type. Ooh, that, that good roll through is so clean. Not a lot of people know that you can uh, roll through the last bit of... Uh, Cloud's clock flash. I did not know that. That's that's good to know. Um, he might die here. Oh, oh he waited just a little bit too long on the recovery because he didn't want to get hit by. Uh, he didn't want to get hit by FD. I also wonder if he hadn't de reversed that cross slash if it might have helped him stay alive. He would have been just ever so slightly closer. Or, or and he was just barely missed there. But right now. Now, Zion retaliating with the kill. Both these players back, back even. However, that up B is going to cause off to just a little bit, but he manages to avoid a, a true punish and the blade beam here. They are getting that up B for some good damage, and he's, he's taking control of the second top arc early, but whiffs on that F smash there. Fumes punishes on... Uh, oh, my goodness. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh, <laughs> that was almost so amazing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he, he had the right... Like like, like you said, uh, right now. Fume loves his mix-ups, and he loves to make these... Like, if you can, if, if you're playing afraid versus him, then it's just like, you're just, you are bound to die. Yep. Zion definitely favoring that back there in neutral, which is something I, I've seen, I've seen Spargo do, but I, and I've seen other Cloud uh, do, you know, Spargo, Cola, um, at, at the top level, but I've seen a lot of Clouds do that more, but, okay, there it is, there's the forward error. He, he, he hadn't done it so far in this game, but, but there it is coming out, that forward error. Both the sour spot and sweet spot so good for Cloud to just start in an advantage state. This is a really interesting move. Uh, it's very, it's very patient, and Fume is like taking his time, like uh, because he, he can't. Oh, and the up air! Yeah, that was, that he was just really caught good. his jump and called him out. The stock one, one oh nine for Fume. Let's see what his extra credit he is here. Very good opportunity for him to take firm control oh of this goodness. game. Finds thirty seven so far, but Ooh. the up smash. People talk about it. it's back air and up smash, I think, are Cloud's best kill options in this game. And just, boy, you just pull the trigger on those whenever you want. They just find kills. Oh, 100%. Uh, if you notice uh, in this match, uh, they're doing a really good job at staying up. Wow, he followed the up B. They're yeah, no, SDI is, is crazy. I keep, forget, limit. I keep forgetting you can SDI instead of just like DIing it. Yep, you can SDI. You can SDI through it actually, so you can end up behind them and miss oh, okay. the downward hit. But you also can SDI um, up and away, and sometimes just fall out the front. Uh, here though, now we see Zion bringing it all the way back and taking the lead just by a couple percent on this last stock. But for all intents and purposes, even Fium doing a great parry and, and getting the off stage with great cross slash. There. Now Zion has limit, and honestly, oh, he's that cross yep, slash, and that's yep. the game. He I don't want to say he stole that from Fume, considering how close it got at the end there, but it felt very much like Fume had control of that game. Aim, aim, and then Zion just said, you know what, never mind. I'm, I'm going to take this one anyways. 100%. Uh, that mix-up is for now. <laughs> like, uh, if, you, if Cloud has limit, just don't back air. Uh, like, if he back airs your shield and he continues to pressure you back with back air, you have to get out of there because it's like, like, if you try to jump, guess what? You get cross slash, you get up bead. There's a myriad of things that can just happen. And especially, like, being on the platform, not having the access to shield drop there is really, that's such a hard predicament to get yourself out of. Absolutely. And, and Cloud cross slash, not necessarily killing without limit, but always doing so much damage active for so long. Yes. It's a great thing to catch a jump or a wave punish. And beautiful use of that there by Zion. Here we see back to PS2. It makes the best game. The down tilt, but the landing up arrow. That move is so silly. It combos at any percent, at any point. It just combos into something. And Ooh, down, air, down air combos? I didn't know that. <laughs> that. That I haven't seen that, but beautiful job by, by Fume there again with the mix-ups. I haven't seen him go for nearly as much 
many true strings as I've seen other Void players do, but his mix-ups are so on point, it might not even matter. Let's see, what, what do you think Zion could do? Uh, what, sorry, uh, what do you think Fume could do uh, to adapt to how Zion is playing right now? I'd like to see him, I mean, he's holding, he's just running in a lot, and I'd like to see him take, again, a couple more opportunities to just reset to neutral, because he's letting himself get caught by some of the, by just a, a couple too many. Like, he's going in, he's chasing him, and he's just getting punished for that win. If he, like, there, that was beautiful. Like, he see, but once again, he just kind of isn't stepping far enough back to get out of the range of Cloud Sword, and I would I would like to see him take a little bit back, even if it means he doesn't get as strong a punish. He just needs to play a little more patient, and I know Cloud has limit, and I know that limit Cloud is scary, but it also has 15 seconds, and you can, and you can punish him, and... And, and he's just kind of putting himself in these situations where he'll go from getting really good juggles, but then he overextends just a little bit and gets reversal. And that's where Zion's made his bread and butter is on Fume's overextension. I, I couldn't agree more. Uh, if you notice, Fume is getting hit by a lot more uh, forward air. And like it's, it's, it's very pivotal that you pay attention to how, like... Oh, the up yo, till catch damage. landing with a cross flash. That was a great mix up by Zion on there. there. Er, Zion definitely using in this oh, game dead. a lot more. Ooh, Cloud's recovery coming back to bite him there without the limit. Void down tilt, one of the best S moves in the game at just ledge trapping just like that. Very simple, easy ledge trap right there. Er, Zion this game using more up air, using more fair, using more nair. Definitely, whereas game one, he definitely relied a lot more on the back air and neutral, and, and those mix ups, I think, are catching Fuse's catching adaptation a little bit. Okay, I see. But see, see now this is where you need to click Cloud in a corner, and it's just like really hard to like. You have to play very patiently because like Cloud has just like such wild, uh, wide heart that he can cover it. Well, he oh, and he got the cross flash again, just about at the end of that cross, uh, that limit timer. But he he lets it get, and he gets put in that situation in the first place because he gets hit once again by the forward air, air fume. Just again getting caught right at the yep. edge. All of these situations, he's not in Cloud's face, but he is getting caught just at the edge of the sword. And if he just took a couple steps back, I think his micro spacing just in this matchup is just ever so slightly off today. Hey, but. A lot of his ideas are right, it's just his, his he's overextending yes. just a little and, and Zion is doing a real good job of punishing him. Definitely feeling a little too greedy with that with that down B there on the limit. But, but it doesn't matter because he's up a stock and he can, he can go for that and he's an advantage. So absolutely. He didn't die off of it, you know. And that, uh, and that up till, up till yeah. it, that weak hit up till definitely not what Fume wanted there, sending a really good, not great angle, but calling out that down air with the back air and honestly Zion very barely not dying here. This is a good position for Fume, and I think if he gets the stock, Roy, Roy has a very, has is very good at racking up damage quickly, and, and I think if, even though oh oh it, it's kill percent with that stock oh not the stock there, there Ooh, but, good chase good chase from Fume and, and good juggle not letting him land with that limit. Mm -hmm. It, it, if he can, oh, the dash attack just not barely Great killing. In, in, but I think if he if he can in win neutral here and, and start racking up damage, I think this game is closer than it than it seems. Zion has conditioned his shield uh, like very very much. So and the shield, shield poke. poke on the yeah. back air there, just barely not killing. Interested to see what Zion has here with the blade beam cross up. Hadn't. Well, I think he'd only pulled out a couple blade beams all match, even though it's pretty good in this match. Oh, the tools to, tears, tools to deal with a projectile like that, and and it pays off there as he catches the blade blade beam to catch the get up off ledge. If if you noticed, uh, Zion conditioned the neutral get up because he's been uh, back airing his <laughs> back airing him from ledge, and he was like, all right, I I'm gonna let this blade beam work. It's an active hitbox. You can't get up and do it if you jump. Uh, you get hit. If you neutral get up, you get hit. Potential roll. You also get hit. So it's like, close that up.